Hello, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, depending on where you're located. Um, my name is Helen, and I am here with H&G Spirit Messages. My messages are both psychic and tarot messages that I will be delivering today. I also have my guide, my grandmother, uh, who was also uh, psychic as well. I want to share with you today uh, what I have as far as for Thursday um, messages First of all, the common energy, which is for air, fire, water, and earth, as I usually do. I've taken some notes, so I'm going to share them with you, uh, what came to me this morning. So the first thing that comes up to me is um, somebody is um, right now wanting, um, they want you to um, either take control or they want you to take your control back. I also feel like for some of you, this could be um, you trying to reach out to somebody. Maybe you're sending messages or you're trying to call somebody. Somebody's not responding. They're either not responding to your text or they're not answering your calls. For some of you, there is obstacles right now. For some reason, some of these obstacles are coming up as um, something hard to manage. Or it's also not being able uh, to be together. Um, for some of you, or not being able to get together. There also may be distance in between the two of you, which is creating um, a lot of hardship. It's creating a lot of anxiety. It's also creating um, a lot of stress. Some of you are having trouble focusing or, or um, being able to plan your day accordingly. Some of you get overwhelmed with certain feelings or um, certain behaviors uh, that your mind tends to go to or your behaviors tend to uh, take on these actions that don't complement you or your personality. There's some things about you that feel as if there's there's got to be some other way. There's got to be something I can do. There's, there needs to be something that I can say to this person or do to get this person's attention so that we can talk and we can work something out. For a lot of you... Um, it feels like today you're going to try to focus or achieve a goal, something that you've been striving for, something that's been on your mind, something that you're trying to, um, again, accomplish or get to. But it's something that you may have postponed or ignored or procrastinated for quite some time. But today, something you're going to rethink something. Something's going to take uh, uh, precedence over something else. For some of you, sooner is going to be better than later. So for some of you, something needs to get off your chest. Something needs to get said. Something needs to be brought to somebody's attention because it needs to be handled now. Some of you just, you've had enough of it. You've had enough. You can't take it much more and you're going to address something today with someone. Hmm. You may even call somebody out on this shit today. For some of you, clarity is going to be given to you in a certain situation today. The truth is going to pretty much rise up right in front of you. It's pretty much going to smack you in the face for some of you. So be prepared and be, be careful. Don't allow yourself to get angry or agitated. Listen to what the truth is being brought in front of you, what it's saying. And then just take it and then later on break it down. Break it down. Put it all together, write it down if you have to, but then break it down into pieces so that it makes sense. You need to look at the other person's point of view of why this is coming about. For some of you, somebody may bring a choice to the table, a choice, a decision that you're going to have to make because I keep seeing the two of pentacles. So it's a choice or decision about your money. It's a choice or decision today about your location, where you're moving, what you're doing. But it is definitely going to be a choice that you weren't sure or didn't didn't know was coming that you're going to have to do. Somebody, even a landlord, may be putting pressure on you about either paying more rent, rent going up in price, or moving out. And only having a certain time period to do that. For some of you, somebody's sitting and pondering. That means thinking, um, stalling, um, weighing something out maybe. Balancing something. Somebody's definitely trying to 
put things in the proper perspective so that they can plan accordingly. I don't know who that is. Somebody else may have decided today, you know what? I'm not giving in. I'm not talking to them. Um, I'm not compromising. I am not moving on this. I've made my decision and I'm firm about it. And that's it. Somebody is saying I'm not being talked into something that I don't want to do. Some of you need to be careful of pushy car salesmen. So if you're going to buy a car today, do not allow somebody to force you, convince you, or push you into a vehicle that you know you can't afford. For some of you, you may be feeling lost or distance, distance or distant from someone, not feeling the same as you did before. Something happened or something occurred that changed the way you're feeling toward them now. Something may have even betrayed your trust that they did or said or um, that they kept from you. Maybe they kept something hidden. And this definitely is changing the way you're feeling about them. For some of you, you don't want any part of this person. For some of you, the thought of this person just disgusts you. For some of you, there's going to be an opportunity for you to explain to that person when they come to you face to face to tell them, you know what? When you did this, or when you said that, you, you really turned me off. You really kind of just made me shake my head and say, you know what? I, I don't believe I ever even liked you. I can't believe that I wanted to be with you. I had no idea this is the way you felt about something. Or I had no idea this is the way you would treat me. Or I had no idea these were your beliefs. For, for some of you, someone is definitely trying to create... Two people to break up, two people to argue, two people to go at each other's throats, two people to fight. And the goal or the motive for this is so that this person who's creating this or trying to cause these arguments or these fights or these disagreements, it's because this person who's causing it, maybe it's you, maybe it's somebody else, is trying to break you and somebody else up or maybe you are trying to break somebody up because you want them for yourself. But that karma is going to come back to you. And then when you do get this person, it won't last because it is on false pretenses. They didn't come voluntarily. They were manipulated or tricked in order to leave somebody to come towards you. So I want you to be really, really careful with that. Really, really careful. Somebody today has extreme fatigue. Somebody is not feeling well at all. Somebody is definitely... Um, pushing themselves to the limit, maybe not sleeping well at night. You may be taking on too many hours at work, too much responsibility, or you may be overwhelmed just with life in general right now. A lot of you are being advised to sit quietly, to meditate, to get yourself acclimated to what's going on. And again, take things one day at a time. Take each problem, one problem at a time. All right, now getting started for the daily. So, first of all, first and foremost, again, it is Thursday. I believe it's August 13th. I'll correct that if it's not. I'll put the date on the front. Um, but it is Thursday. So, Capricorn. Starting with Capricorns. Capricorn, you may be feeling like um, it's all for nothing right now. You might be feeling like... You can't handle this anymore. Some of you are going through uh, a tower moment right now. Some of you um, may miss somebody a lot. Or some of you may regret something. Or may be feeling um, truly hurt, disappointed, rejected in a situation. But don't worry about that today, Capricorn. Because even though you're feeling all these emotions, even though you're going through this storm right now, soon you're going to see a rainbow. All right, Taurus, Taurus, somebody speaks out of turn or somebody definitely has a secret that they're speaking about. Now, it's either a secret you told them and they're telling, they're telling somebody else or you find out a secret about someone. For some of you today, a package may arrive, something unexpected. Some of you may have ordered something and forgot all about it or some of you may have gotten a package accidentally. Not sure how that happened, but mm, you're just shaking your head like, wow, I didn't get this. 
I didn't get this. Or for some of you, someone is sending you a gift. For some of you, Taurus. Again, this is Taurus. For some of you, somebody's wanting to talk about how this cycle got started in the first place. Somebody's definitely dealing with a very deep topic, a deep subject. You want the details about something, Taurus. Um, in the past, or your partner's past. Maybe you're wanting to talk about your partner's past because you're fearing that your partner is still messing around with their ex. So be careful of that. Be careful of that. Virgo. Virgo. For some of you, right now, it feels like it's hard to get back on track. For some of you today, it's feeling like um, this job might be uh, wearing on you or this job might be boring you or this job that you're in just might feel like, you know what, it's just not the right fit. Some of you will definitely still show up. You'll still go to work. You'll still handle what you need to. Some of you are working a.m. shift early, early, or some of you are working the very late overnight shift. Somebody is definitely planning on stopping by your home or stopping by your house to see you if they see your vehicle or if they can tell that you are home. Somebody is going to come. Somebody, this person may be juggling right now. This person may be juggling decisions and choices that they've made in the past. This person may also um, have a little bit of confusion in their mind. Not sure what they want to do, but they're going to come by because they want to talk to you. They want to try to figure something out. Gemini. Somebody is confused. Someone feels that they have been lied to. Somebody thinks that it was all wrong. Something was set up. Something was planned. Something just, it's its not fitting. It's like these false accusations came about from out of the blue. And somebody doesn't understand why this would happen. Why would somebody want to create this breakup? Or why would somebody want to say all these false things? But for some of you, it is a jealous person that is around. This person um, is on the lookout. This person is watching you closely. This person is definitely hanging around. And this person is definitely feeling as if there's something they're going to find. Libra. It feels like Libras are afraid to, uh, to stay, but they're also afraid to go. Some Libras, um, you're looking... Uh, at a situation stubbornly in one way, in one aspect, but at the same time, Libra, something presents itself to you today and you're going to feel stuck for a second. You're going to be frozen like, um, mm, how do I handle this is what you're going to say. But I, I'm, I'm not sure, but you're going to kind of be like, I don't know if I want to be with you. I don't know if I want to talk to you. I really don't know if it's worth going back again for. It seems like, Libras, you've gone back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Sometimes you feel like a burden or you feel like they are a burden to you. And then other times you feel like, I like them around. But for a lot of you, you got very, very comfortable in this toxic situation. That now it is a normal for you. So that's why you kept taking it back. Because you got used to it. You got used to being sad. You got used to being uncomfortable. You got used to being lied to. It doesn't make it right. It just means that you're afraid of change. And right now, you're settling or staying stuck. Because you don't want to be alone. Aquarius. You are happy to restore something fast. You're happy to get back on track. You're happy and wanting more with within yourself and within yourself and a partner. Somebody definitely tries to go really fast with you. Somebody tries to call you, talk to you, jump in bed with you and whatever. Trying to get right back. They're not trying to earn it slowly. They're not trying to build back up the trust. They're just trying to come back, return, and get right back into the intimate part of this. Be very careful with that today, Aquarius. Cancer. Cancer, you might have planned something with them. You might have planned a reunion. You might have planned to get together. You might have planned dinner. You might have planned something with them. But something changed quickly. One minute they were talking as if 
Okay, it's a great idea. Let's do it. And the next minute they had second thoughts. So be careful. Whoever you're trying to make plans with, whoever you're trying to get back on track with, whoever you're trying to be with, may get a difference of opinion for a minute, may start to hesitate, may procrastinate because they're unsure. They're just unsure. Give them time. Give them time today. They'll get back to you and then this will work out. But at first, they're going to be a little bit nervous. Pisces, today. A long distance relationship is coming back towards you. Somebody who has either been away from you for quite a while or somebody who lives far from you. There is going to be some kind of communication. This may be online. Uh, for some of you, this may be um, over uh, communication through um, electronics. But I do feel like a lot of you, somebody's going to realize that the other person has grown a lot since you've been apart. Somebody's going to realize that somebody finally figured it out exactly what their shit was and they own their own shit right now and they're taking responsibility and accountability for what they did. Very soon, you're going to find this answer out from somebody and somebody's going to come to you, Pisces, and make a promise. Scorpios, you can't get somebody off your mind. You may deny that they don't make you crazy, but they do. You may, Scorpio, um, try to say that, you know what, they're better off or I'm better off without them, but you're not or they're not. Somebody may have tried to tell you, Scorpio, that they don't need you and um, they've wasted their time and they're moving forward. But you're going to find out, Scorpio, that this person is actually missing the hell out of you. This person is wanting to talk and communicate with you. And, and this person is definitely hoping, hoping that you'll come back. They're hoping that you'll come back. Aries. Aries. Aries, there's lots of opportunity around you, mm. but you're afraid of something about questioning or somebody questioning you or somebody wanting answers. You're not willing to open yourself up that much because you're afraid to get hurt. I also feel like, Aries, you've been going kind of in your mind back and forth with this person and flirting and having a good time. And then as soon as it gets to the point of getting together, something happens. And then you get back together and you start talking and texting and flirting and sending messages or whatever on the WhatsApp or um, on your regular cell, whatever. And then it goes quiet. It's dry. There's no communication. And then all of a sudden, it's back sparking again. You guys don't know whether you have to put a fire out or to create a fire. For some of you, somebody is avoiding you or avoiding commitment. Somebody might be right now playing this back and forth game. One minute they're on the stage ready to act, perform, and show off. And the next minute they got stage fright. For some of you, there is going to be a reality check today. For some of you, somebody might lose their job. I don't feel like it's you, but I feel like somebody's going to tell you they got fired. So be really careful with that. Leo, Leo, somebody is stressed out. Somebody is overwhelmed. Somebody's overworked. Somebody's pushing themselves way too hard. Maybe that's you. Maybe it's your partner. But today, I feel like today's a day where you're kind of going to wake up and be like, you know what? I got this. You know what? I'm going to add something else to the equation because that's going to create more balance for me. For some of you, there's a purchase going to be made today. Be careful of overspending because you can get it cheaper somebody somewhere else and you can save $50 or more. So please check out where else you can purchase it before you make a big purchase. Some of you are signing contracts today, signing agreements, signing apartment leases, whatever, car loans, something, signing. Be careful of what you're signing. Sagittarius. Working with your hands today, doing a lot of work with your hands, creativity, painting, drawing, sculpting. I also feel like for some of you, um, you may have just got news of somebody in the hospital. You may have just got news that somebody, um, you thought, oh God, is it COVID? But it's not. Oops, I shouldn't have said that word. Cancel, cancel that, cancel that. But for some of you, um, you were worried that somebody got sick. You were worried somebody had something that everybody was getting. You were worried that it was something, but it's not. It's not that. It's not that. For some of you, um, it may be uh, a quick surgery. For some of you, it could be something as simple as appendicitis. For some of you, somebody is definitely around you. Somebody's going to show up and they're going to show out. So somebody's going to kind of, I think it's a friend who you have a disagreement with. Somebody's going to really like talk a whole bunch of junk. Somebody's definitely going to, um, somebody's really definitely going to make a scene. 
also feel like some of you, if you work in a convenience store, somebody may shoplift in front of you today. You may see somebody shoplift today. For some of you, Sagis, you're going to find out the truth in the situation. I also feel like you're going to learn a very important lesson that you're not going to forget. And you're going to share with other people so they don't have to go through it too. Some of you, be careful of speeding tickets today. Slow down driving. Slow down driving. So, with that being said, this is your daily for Thursday.